Okay, in the last video we added the contact component to our um, site, the contact us link. If you click on it, it takes us to a contact name and um, address and number and then the fields and automatically generates the um, uh, forms that you could send and then to send somebody an email. And then if we wanted to edit that, we go back to our contact. Uh, essentially what we had to do was we had to go to components, contacts, create a category, and then we could create a contact to add to that category. Right now, I could change this to actually give it a name. You know, I could say Dan A, which is me. I could actually give it, give myself a name, contacts position. You could say um, you could say anything in here that you wanted. Um, and say uh, company contact, your address, all that stuff, zip code, and country. And then if you wanted to show something like the email address, if you wanted to show it, you would just click show here and then apply or save. And then when you went back to you could refresh this window in the browser and you see there's my name now showing up at the top and then you see here my email address shows up here and then my zip code showed up here and all that stuff so um, that's the contact position now the last piece and then we'd be done is let's see um, is our module on the right hand side and for this piece, what we'll do is we'll need to create our first module. So we'll go to Module Manager and we'll hit New. And so once again, we're going to put a little module on the right hand side here. And I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, so um, we need to go to the Module Manager. So Extensions, Module Manager. Okay, and you can see right now we only have one module, which is our main menu module. That's our left menu, the menu on the left hand side. And you can see the type of it here, mod, main menu, right? It, it's the only one that comes default to start with in an empty Joomla website. Its position is in the left position. So we're going to create a new module, and we'll call our new module. Um, um, I don't know. We'll call it, uh, we'll see here. Well, if it's going to be a custom HTML module, that's what it's going to be, and then I'll name it in a minute. So custom HTML module, hit next. And you can see here the module type, custom, and title. In his, he does it and calls it um, demo site, chapter 5 demo site. So I'll say demo site, show title, yes, enabled, yes. But in the position, instead of on the left, we're going to put it on the right, okay? And then it's a custom HTML module. So um, also we can tell you where we want this module to show up, where and when. Do we want it to show up on all of the pages, all of the links that we have here, or just some of them? And since it's an HTML module, what HTML do we want to show up there? And we could say, well, we want some I don't know, links here. So we could say HTTP colon forward slash forward slash yahoo.com. You know, it could say go to these sites for more information, let's say. Right? And then we put some sites here that we wanted people to go to. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash danscourses.com. Okay, and there's our, we're done. So we hit save. Now if we go to the front end of our site and hit refresh, you'll see that the demo site module shows up here, right, on the right hand side. We've got some links here that are working by default. 
if we go to any of these pages, it shows up on the right hand side. Our services, services, it's, it shows up on the right hand side. Even on our contacts, it's there on the right hand side. If we wanted to change that, I'm going to go back in the module manager, go to demo site, and have it only show up on some of the pages. I could click select menu items, and I'd say I want it to show up on the home page, and the hold down the shift key and click about us and our services, but not on these other pages. Let's say, and hit save. And now, if I refresh that, you'll see it doesn't show up on the contacts page. It doesn't show up on Dan's blogs page or the services page, but it does show up on our services, about us, and the home page.